Make New Appointment, Quick Start. Let's take a look at how to make a new appointment. Click the Make New Appointment button on the side toolbar to start the wizard and search for our customer. Enter the first few letters of the customer's name and press Enter. Select the customer's name on the list and press Enter again. And here we select which vehicle the appointment is for. So let's select the Mini and press the Enter key again. This is the Appointment Information screen. The phone number is the first field highlighted to verify their phone number, and then you can select or add a second phone number. And I typically use a tab button throughout this screen. You can select the driver of this car from the customer record, and the Mini is Walter's car. Enter the appointment date, or click Select to choose from the calendar. Enter the appointment time, and we can change the promise date and promise time and we'll just leave the work status as appointment. If the customer is going to wait for their vehicle, check the customer waiting box to display waiting in red type on the service counter when they come in for their appointment. I really like this feature to be able to keep that customer's vehicle a top priority. Now let's select the service rider, click the select button and choose from the list, and we'll just double click on their name, then enter a quoted price for the job if a price was given, and the quoted hours are used to be able to reserve that many hours for that appointment on the appointment calendar. Now let's select the technician. Enter the technician 1, the primary technician assigned to the job, by clicking the select button. Now this technician's initials will be automatically assigned to all labor services on the repair order. And if your shop uses numbered key tags or hats, it's entered here. Using the radio buttons, select to discard old parts or return old parts to the customer. Click the Next button. So here, under Reasons for Service, you select their vehicle problem, their service requests, or you can enter a freeform note. Let's click the Add Requests button. So here are all the requests for service in the system. Click a category on the left to narrow your results to choose from, and let's select one. And remember, we can add additional information from the customer here. Click OK, and this request is added to the appointment. And last, we could add a note for this appointment as just a blank entry field. Click Finish, and this saves your appointment to the service counter. This concludes the lesson on Make New Appointment Quick Start.